song, puppets, fun and mime. Welcome to the story time. Hello Augustians, how are you? Did you have water today? Did you study today? Do you want to play today? Do you want to sit today? Do you want to go out and hug that friend today? No, yes, yes, no, no, yes. Tell me, are you allowed to say no? When an elder does something that you don't like, do you say no? If you say no, do you get heard? Hmm, let's see. Today, I've brought a story by Janine Sanders and illustrated by Cherry Zamazing. And it's called, No Means No. Now, let's see what the authors have to tell us. When Auntie Jeannie asks me for a kiss and I don't want to, no means no. I can choose to blow her a kiss, shake her hand or give her a high five. But if I don't want a hug or a kiss, no means no. When it's bath time and my mother asks if she can wash and dry my private parts and I say, no, thanks, I can do it all by myself. No means no. Are you listening, Augustians? If you don't want to be touched, if you don't want to be kissed, if you don't want to be hugged, be it your mother, father, grandparents, family, anybody in the family, anybody in the school, they have to respect your no. Always remember, no means no. I can wash and dry my own private parts today, tomorrow or the next day because my body is my body and I am the boss of it. Sometimes my big cousin looks after me. We run races and have fun on the swings La 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 la. But if he wants to wrestle and play tickling games and I don't want to, no means no. We can build a giant sand castle in the sand or play catch with a ball. I mean, we can play so many games, right? But if I don't want to wrestle or play tickling games, no means no. When someone asks to hold my hand at school, and I want to walk all by myself. No means no. Sometimes I like to walk by myself and I don't want to hold anyone's hand. I can say no thanks or not today as kindly as I can. But at the same time, we have to be careful not to hurt ourselves on the road. When people ask me things and I say no, I don't mean maybe and I don't mean I'm not sure. What I really mean is no. So even though I may be small, I am strong and I have a voice that is loud and clear. So when I say no, no means no. That was the end of this story. But did you hear her? Do you ever feel like her? That you are saying no and people around are not listening to you? Then do you know what you have to do? Yes, you know. You have to take this story to that elder and tell them that my no means no. Lovely. All right, Augustine. See you next time. Bye-bye.